this is Holly at Caring as Leads. I'm just going to run through a quick tutorial with you today on how to create your own Zoom account on your Samsung tablet. So hopefully by now you should have downloaded Zoom already. However, don't worry if not, you can easily download it for free from the Google Play Store which you can see on this homepage here which is the icon with the blue, green, yellow and red triangle. Alternatively, if you are hoping to get a bit more support with downloading the app, then we've made a tutorial for you to watch which will talk you through that in a bit more detail. But if you do have Zoom downloaded, if you swipe upwards on your homepage to come into your apps, the first thing that we need to do when creating an account with Zoom is tapping on the Zoom icon to open up the app. Now, this is the login page where it asks us if we want to join a meeting, sign up or sign in. So because we haven't got an account yet, we will just need to tap on the sign up button. So here it says, for verification, please confirm your date of birth, month, day and year. So if we just tap on where it says month, day, year, we bring up a box where we can change the date of birth by pressing the plus to go up or the minus to go down and we can just change it to our date of birth which I'm going to do now and once you're done we just need to press the button that says set and now the next step is to enter our email address first name and last name into the boxes so if we tap on where it says email we can just pop our email address in like so then we tap on where it says first name to put our first name in and then finally we can pop our last name in then we press on the big blue button that says sign up and here it says activation email sent check your email to activate your account so now what we need to do is come right out of Zoom by pressing the circle at the bottom of the tablet like so and we need to go into our email account. So like myself, I created this Zoom account with my Gmail email Gmail email <laughs> Gmail email address. So I'm just going to go into Gmail and you do that by pressing the Google icon with the nine icons within it there. And then you can see Gmail, so we just need to tap on the icon that says Gmail. And hopefully, here we go, we've got an email from Zoom that says please activate your Zoom account. So we can go ahead and click on that. Here it says welcome to Zoom. To activate your account, please click on the button below to verify your email address. Once activated, you'll have full access to Zoom meetings and chat. Activate account. And what we do next is tap on that big orange button that says activate account. So now it's taken us to the next stage of creating our account. To see the rest of the screen, we swipe to the left with our index finger like so. And it's fab that it's remembered our name. Uh, so all we need to do now is create a password. Now I think it'll tell us here what we need to include in the password by tapping here. It must have at least eight characters, have at least one letter, have at least one number and include both uppercase and lowercase characters. So I'm just going to pop a password in here. It's probably a good idea to write it down somewhere as well just so you don't forget it. And you know that you've met all the requirements as each bullet point here has gone green, which is good. We just need to tap on confirm password and write it in again and then the next step is uh, we just need to tap in the box where it says I'm not a robot now this is sometimes just a little test that Google does to make sure that we're not a robot creating an account so it says here select all images with a fire hydrant now if you want this reading out to you by Google as well you can tap where it has that headphones icon and it will read the speech aloud but I'm just going to fill that in now and once you're done and you're happy with those selections tap the blue box that says verify and then you've got a big green tick there to say that you've done it and then we just need to tap on the blue box that says continue here the next step again swipe across with your finger 
we don't need any of this uh, we don't need to pop any colleagues email addresses in so we can just skip this step by tapping on that box and finally swipe across again we don't need to start a meeting now we can just tap go to my account and this should take us to our zoom account the final step that we need to do before we're all done is to come right out of this again by pressing the circle at the bottom of the screen swiping upwards on your tablet screen to come back to zoom open zoom and if we just tap close at the top left corner of the screen cancel at the top left corner of the screen and now we're back to that original starting point that we started with to sign up but now obviously because we've created our account if we just tap sign in rather than sign up and here we can just pop those original details in that we've just created the account with like the password and then we press that big blue button that says sign in and here we are we've created our very own zoom account so thanks for watching goodbye